Hey y'all, hey, welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, I am Desi, and we are back with another video. Today's video is going to be an Abercrombie & Fitch haul. Actually, it's just gonna be the jeans, an Abercrombie & Fitch jeans haul. I have been obsessing over their jeans lately. When I tell you, they're the only jeans company that I know that gets it right every single time. Y'all know I love Zara. And Zara, I will always rock with you. I will always rock with you, even though you got cardboard jeans and you gotta stretch them out for them to fit how they're supposed to. But guys, I'm putting Abercrombie jeans number one. Curve Love jeans number one. If you don't know, now you know, and you will know after this video. I'm not gonna make this video long at all. I just wanted to show you guys some of the jeans that I picked up. This is not sponsored, I wish it was. Make sure you guys comment. Hit that like button and subscribe, and maybe I'll get a chance to work with Abercrombie one day soon. Anywho, let's go ahead and get off into this video, guys. Okay, so I do want to go over sizing really briefly. I do get my Abercrombie and Fish jeans, once again, from the Curve Collection. I get mine in a size 25 or a zero regular. I don't get the short ones because I don't want them too short. I'm 5'2", and I am petite, but I'm not like short short if that makes sense. So I do like my jeans to hit a little bit below my ankle, so that's why I don't get the short ones. But I love the regular. These are, um, well, I'm not even gonna give you guys the prices because they might be on sale. I know all the jeans that I get are typically on sale, but I did get the 90s straight ultra high rise. You guys know I love high rise jeans and they're my favorite. I got these black ones and they're so nice. They're kind of like this vintage black grayish look. I love the wash of these jeans and when I tell you they're jeans, literally cinch you in at the waist as you guys can see it gives that cinch to look already like no tailoring no nothing fits right at the waist fits perfect on the legs they're so form-fitting they look amazing on the butt if you don't have a butt it's gonna make you look like you have a butt I love these jeans these are so cute I love these for a black on black look I love these with the black denim shirt and with the black this is just is beautiful Okay, so I highly recommend that for the fall winter time, of course, grab yourself a nice pair of washed out black jeans. You definitely need them. I don't really know who actually still wears like the jet black jeans. I haven't seen that in a minute. I don't really prefer that because they end up getting kind of like ashy when you wash them. But these washed out black jeans are perfect. Okay, so for the next pair of jeans that I have, once again, in the size 25, zero R. I'll show you guys just so you can see. Oh, can you guys see? Perfect. These are the 90 straight ultra high rise as well. They're in this medium blue color. I think these are super duper cute as well. They do have gold stitching, which kind of gives them that like oldie but goodie vibe. And I also like that all of their pockets have this square patch. It's always gonna be like a dark patch on the jean and I like that. It's very minimalistic. It's not so apparent, but every time I see that patch, I know it's Abercrombie. These jeans do the same thing. They cinch in at the waist. They make the butt look really good. The only difference is these came with this slit on the knee. Now I would prefer jeans without the slit. I think they have the same color without the slit. If you can grab those, I definitely think that that would be a lot smarter because they would be more wearable. And sometimes the knee slits can end up being a little bit tacky. I don't know why I got these. I got them in the summertime and yeah, I went crazy and I bought so many pairs of jeans that look exactly the same. But I highly recommend a pair of jeans like this. If you're into the slit knee, go for it. If not, they have a pair that does not have a slit and they are gorgeous. Okay, another pair of jeans that I got. These are a little bit lighter, as you guys can see, and they have a little bit of distressing on the back pocket. As you see there, these are the 90s straight low rise. Once again, same back pocket detailing right there. These definitely go a little bit lower as you guys see as well. They do have a dip in the front, obviously because they're low rise, I'm not mad at it. I think this is super duper cute. They make the butt look really, really good. And if you have a flat tummy, these type of jeans are so gorgeous to accentuate your waist. But yeah, these are a little bit on the longer side, kind of. Not really, they're not too long, but they kind of give that boyfriend relaxed vibe. You can definitely wear this with some Birkenstock clogs, a nice white t-shirt, throw a pea coat over it and give that effortless casual it girl look. So yeah, I definitely love that. As you can see, it has a hefty, hefty, hefty hole in the knee, which I'm not mad at it. Like I said, it does give that kind of like relaxed vibe and I do like these in the summertime. I wore these quite a bit in summer. Once again, white t-shirt, throw it on with some sandals, some Birkenstock clogs, and it just gives effortless, throw it on with some sunglasses. It's just so cute. 
It's cute and it's basic. So yeah, highly recommend these jeans as well. Another pair of jeans that I just picked up are these light wash jeans. I think these are so cute. I definitely needed a pair of light wash jeans. I saw someone wearing these jeans in Zara and I was like, oh, I have to go to Abercrombie and grab those jeans. I got these in, same thing, size 25, zero, regular. These are the 90 straight ultra high rise too. Every pair of jeans, once again, that I showed you guys is from the Curve Collection. The thing that I like about these is they are sneaker friendly. They do have this slit on the side, but they're giving straight leg. So they're straight leg with a little bit of spice with the slit on the side. I think that is so cute. The waist is super cinched. I really love the quality of their jeans. I would describe the quality of their jeans being like rigid, but stretchy. Like they have that old school denim feel, which I love that structure, that nice non-stretchable feel, but they have stretch to them. I don't know how they do that but these are fire. I don't even know what the material is. I should have looked at that, but these are so, 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 so good. So yeah, I'm not gonna look into that, but these are bomb and you need these as well. Okay, for the last pair of jeans that I wanted to show you guys, I don't even know if these are still on the website, so if they're not, do not kill me, but they are the high rise mom jeans. Once again, I got these in a size 25, and I actually got these in shorts, so you will see what I'm talking about. So that way you guys know I'm not joking. When I say I don't prefer the short jeans, I like mine regular because they kind of give flooding. I did wash them and that probably has something to do with it too. But yeah, that's why I just go ahead and I get regular. But these are super duper cute. These are, once again, mom jeans. They are very fitted. These are from the Curve Love Collection. Don't know if they're on the website, so I'm not gonna talk about them too much, but these were nice as well. And I still have these. I bought these two summers ago. All right, guys, I feel like I just sped through that so quick and I talked super duper fast and I hope you guys understood everything that I said. I know this video is a little bit boring, but I really wanted to show you guys these jeans so that way you guys can start your quality jean collection as well. Of course, I'm gonna show you guys more things, especially from Zara. I heard that Express has some really good jeans as well, so if you have experienced that, comment down below. If you guys have any other jeans recommendations, oh, I also heard that Hollister has good jeans. I have to check them out. It seems very young esque which is totally fine but i haven't been there in a minute but if you have any recommendations whatsoever as far as jeans go make sure you comment down below and let me know so i can try them out and then do a review for them i am so happy that you watched this video i will see you guys in the next video i love you guys bye